Hey guys, Jay here, welcome to YanzaBattle.com, and I've got another showcase video for you guys. I'd like to show off my newly finished 2 Forge World Canoptic Tombstalkers. Now, this is a model that I have adored for the longest time. I love the look of the creepy, creepy centipede monsters. Um, I've never actually really gotten to play these guys in a game. I got to have them field them in one Apocalypse game, but they really didn't get around to doing much. Um, but just the way they look, oh, I love it. With all of the different legs and uh, their, their scary little pincers and their faces. As you can see on this guy, I even added a, uh, a couple of Scarab Swarm bases, kind of flying a little bit on some stems. And now these guys are really, really fun to put together, or challenging, I like. I thought it was a lot of fun. But each individual leg comes in two pieces, or uh, yeah, two pieces and has to be put together. And it, it turned into a little bit of a pain putting them together, but what I found worked really, really well was I started it out on uh, the first one I put together where I actually have him floating above the base without any legs on, and then uh, once I had him posed on the base that I liked, then I just began adding in the legs. And so actually the legs are not providing any support to him. It's all um, just supported by two pieces of wire. And so I kind of took that up a notch on the second one I put together. As you can see, the second one is a little bit darker. And so on this guy, I actually drilled a hole through each of the little abdomen pieces, and I ran a piece of stiff wire through them all, posed it like that, and then uh, pinned it to the base. And then put in all the little legs. All in all, these things are a lot of fun to put together. I love the little antenna, I love all of their creepy little scary bits, and they're just scream Necron. I wish I could have a dozen in my army, even though that wouldn't be all that practical. I think two is pushing it, unless I'm fighting Dark Eldar. Um, but yeah, these guys are just all around, tons of fun, and gorgeous models. I'd love to work with some more World Forge World pieces if I ever get the chance. Uh, I had a great time with these guys. So if you have any other ideas or techniques you'd like to see us do, please leave in the comments below. If you'd like to see more of our videos, you can visit us at our website at eonsabattle.com. Thanks for watching.